specifically, um, uh, we, we got involved when it was a $6 billion market cap. And here's Art Laffer again in, in my life and in ARC's life. Um, uh, it was a $6 billion cap then. Now it's over a trillion, which is, but we were asking the question, this was 2015, could Bitcoin serve the three roles of money? And we came to the conclusion that it was possible. Art Laffer collaborated. He tore our original paper up. And as we were going through it, I re he said, this is the first, this is the rules-based monetar monetary system I've been waiting for since uh, we left the gold exchange standard, 71, 1971. Right. And I said to him, oh, how big could this be? And he said, well, how big is the US monetary base? And back then, remember, this is a $6 billion cap. Back then, it was a $4.5 trillion monetary base. Today, we're at $8.5 trillion. Uh, and, and Bitcoin's at $1 trillion. And that's, uh, that's just one of its roles, one of its roles. I think the See? most fascinating thing that's happening is in El Salvador. Have you heard they deemed Bitcoin, the president who right. tweets every day, deemed Bitcoin legal tender. And it was a Bloomberg quiz question. Okay. We do it every week. Anyway. Okay. <laughs> and sent a Chivo wallet uh, to every, everyone uh, in the population eligible, so 4 million. 3 million, it had $30 worth of Bitcoin in it. 3 million have, t have downloaded it. Only 1.2 million in that country uh, have a banking relationship. So this is the new bank, digital wallets. And it's going to be true in this country. It's going to be true around the world. So all in. All in.